hey -o, Tom Tommy Thompson, but please call me Tom Tom Tom. And I figured it was time to do another Splinter Cell Chaos Theory upload. Now, in my last video of this, we did the Lighthouse mission, and uh, we're just going to go ahead and continue on with that. We're going to go right on into the next mission, the cargo ship. Now, when I loaded up the game this time, I noticed that I was able to skip that unskippable cutscene that I mentioned before, and honestly, <laughs> I, th I could have sworn you could skip through it, uh, and it turns out you can, but I guess uh, maybe since I recently downloaded it again, because uh, uh, I got a new system, uh, I had to re-download it to the Xbox 360. Uh, I guess maybe it considered it like, oh, this is the first time you've ever played the game, so <laughs> they, uh, they're like, oh yeah, the first time you play it, you got to see this cutscene. Dude, you got to see it because we worked so hard on it. Anyway. Enough of that. Let's go ahead and get in there. Uh, continue the game. Solo. Tom, Tom, Tom. There we go. Uh, load the game. Mission. Going to go ahead and do the cargo ship. As I mentioned, I'm not an expert. Not looking to try hard. Let's just go with normal. Pacific Ocean, 90 kilometers southwest Panama Canal. Hugo Lacerda managed to get away from the lighthouse aboard the Maria Narcissa before you could get to him, board the ship, locate him, and make sure that he is never able to communicate what he may have learned from Morgan Holt. Looks like we gotta go on that ship and, uh, unalive a guy. <laughs> uh, sorry, Lacerda, but, uh, you're, uh, you're on our, uh, most wanted list. You're on our, uh, you're on the kill list. <laughs> Gonna go ahead and skip past the cutscenes, cause you know we're not here for that. We're here for some gameplay. Basically, we just gotta go in there, find Lacerda, take him out, and I believe that uh, weapon crates are a thing in here. Even though we got the weapon crates last time, this time uh, I suppose it's like a tracking system. Like we gotta put trackers on them. Like I mentioned in my last upload, it's been a little while since I've done a full gameplay of this, so it's like, <laughs> oh gosh, so I was kind of blowing smoke out of my ass in the last upload when I'm like, oh yeah, if you fail to put the, uh, if you fail to scan them, you can scan them again on the ship. No, there are weapon crates on the ship, it's just, it's different. This is tracking devices, not scanning barcodes. Anyway, let's, that's enough of that. I'm uh, gonna go ahead with uh, Redding. Reddington's recommendation. I feel like he's got my best interests. He's always got my back. <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> oh gosh, that save Pressure. time though. We just pulled up Silas last dry dock report for the Maria Narcissa. They have a newly installed central alarm system. Don't tell Ooh, me. Ooh, an alarm system. Three alarms and the mission is over. Of course not. This is no video game, Fisher. You don't want the whole place alerted <laughs> to your presence. Keep it under control. And I guess it's only like certain missions where uh, setting off the alarms like fails the mission. I think it's the bank one. There's like the bank one and then there's like a couple other ones that are like that. But uh, not this one. I can be as loud as I want. But let's keep things quiet. Keep things professional. Hey, how you doing? And overboard. Well, why am I not? Am I stuck? Oh, there we go. Yeah. <laughs> I got stuck to the side. But those guys protecting him. Yeah, you're right. They look dangerous. Okay. Oh yeah, you go downstairs. Hey buddy, how you doing? Don't alert this guy. Hey, how you doing? I don't know where that other guy went, so we're gonna take him over here. Play it safe. Good and safe. Hey, hey buddy. Oh, you got some information? Oh, I don't need your information. I got things under control. Best way to hide a body? Nobody. Gotta go over here. And he looks like he's coming back. I think I see something. 
Oh. Whew. Be a little careful about that. Buddy, you coming? Coming over this way? Don't worry, I'm just going to unalive you. Hey, buddy. How you doing? Aw. He went to sleep. I wish I could throw him over the side of the ship, but like, for whatever reason, I can't really seem to figure out how to do that without like, pushing them into it with that uh, hold animation. Oh, I, uh, I didn't see you there. Gotta be careful, man. I'll get talking and I'll just run right into these guys. That'll make for some interesting gameplay, right? Oh yeah, so you know, I remember this game from back when I was a kid. Oh my god! Hey buddy, I can see you over there. You know what, you know what? I have an idea. Dropped him like it was hot. Nah, we don't need to unalive him. Why waste the bullet? Someone has to crew the ship. Turn that off for a bit. Fisher, it looks like Lacerda is spreading around his newfound wealth, paying off debts with Ooh, some of the arms dark again. delivered to him. You want me to scan any more weapons? This crates? way. Better idea. Plan yeah, see, he's talking about it right here. And we can see who they end up getting delivered to. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, see, Reddington, you're smart. You're a smart guy. And then right on cue, weapon crate. Good job, Sam. That's the first crate. Keep your eyes oh, peeled thank for you. any more. All right. Ups a daisy. Ups a daisy. Over here. Fisher, we just intercepted a radio call from the <laughs> Maria Narcissa. She's reporting a hull leak and asking for an escort. I just love the, the name Maria sick. Narcissa. No, but apparently several compartments are flooded. You'll need to activate the bilge in the forward machine room to access all the cargo holds. Oh, you think so? Fisher, those compartments are flooded. You need to activate the emergency hmm. build pump to drain them. I love how he's like, those compartments are flooded. I can see the water. <laughs> I mean, you guys can see that, right? Ooh. Hey, buddy. How you doing? Hi, buddy. Mmm, step by step. Don't worry. I'm gonna turn the lights out. Mm, how can you sleep with all this noise? There we go. He's sleeping. I go over here. There should be a large turn on the pumps. That you can use to drain the forward cargo hold. I'll find it. Thanks, Redding. We got it. Like, that's the third time you've mentioned pumps. We we got it, okay? We know we gotta use the pump system. I swear to God, you mentioned pumps one more time. I'm gonna abort the mission myself and go find you. You gonna start that pump there or what? Don't know how this stupid thing works. <laughs> Captain Diego said, hurry up or we'll sink. Well, if I do it wrong, we might sink faster. Then don't do it wrong. Don't do it wrong. Oh yeah, good advice. We're gonna... Oh, I keep going back and forth. <laughs> I'm gonna go over here. Come on. You're coming. Come on. Mm. Smooth. Hey, buddy. You didn't hear that? Didn't hear no scuffle?
Don't you dare activate the alarms. I know that's the combat music, but he didn't draw his arm, firearm. He didn't shout out. I'm using a silenced weapon on a loud ship. Yeah. No alarms. Yeah, I swear, like, they'll sometimes just sound the alarm for no reason. Good job. Okay. That'll train oh, I don't know how it works. Now you can search for the bill of lading attached to Lacerda shipments. Alright. Mm, we're gonna go this way. Back the way we came. Mostly because I like vents. Vents are my friend. I spend more time in these vents than I do out of these vents. A little suspicious. <laughs> Woo. This is another security feature like no one's ever thought of. Like, who's gonna think about the vents? Like, oh yeah, we should probably seal that vent so no one can crawl through it. Like. No one's thinking that. Like, even after the fact of this mission, like, they're gonna look through the ship and be like, how did he get through here? We don't know. I'm betting that Lacerda's shipping container is somewhere in this compartment. The bill of lading should be mounted on the side. Oh yeah, you think so? Oh, okay, if I can climb. Good work, Sam. It looks like whoever delivered these arms to Lacerda was operating through a proxy. Ooh, I hurt my, hurt my shins on that one. Offshore bankers? Yeah, cigar chomping kind. Great. I love bureaucrats. You still need to recover the transit ledger so we can figure out who else Lacerda is dealing with. Try the ship's office. They should have that information. Yeah, I figured as much. <laughs> Have you had a look around this boat? They just walk right yeah. past me. Tell me you found a library. Somewhere on the top deck, on the side, and there's a powered launch on the stern. Think there is enough <laughs> for everyone? Nope. Yeah, I wouldn't trust them. <laughs> Are you okay? So, hey, you still. <laughs> Smooth. Gonna put this body down here. Hey, are you okay? Yep, he's fine. Totally fine. We're gonna take him just because I am a horrible human being. We're gonna drop this unconscious guy on top of his dead friend. <laughs> he's gonna wake up and be like, oh! Ninety-nine. Sweet dreams. No, yeah, that's just the other entrance. Sensors in your suit are detecting a lot of fumes down there. Yeah, I can smell it. Some kind of gas leak. Could be. We're gonna save it right here because this room is filled with gas. And if they fire a weapon in here, or if I fire a weapon in here, it will blow up. And if I don't save here. I have to restart the whole mission, and nobody wants to see that. Saving the game. To be a serious explosive hazard. We can't have any firing in the engine room. Wonderful. And don't expect the enemy to be smart enough to realize that. They might still open fire on you if they see you. I get the message. I'll be discreet. I think there's a guy over here. Yep, right there. Come on, buddy. Smooth. Ain't nobody gonna find that body. <laughs> and they're talking about the gas. Like, oh, what's that smell?
You gonna move? You gonna move? I don't want to get all the way over there and have you like turn around and be like, Oh! What is that? Get over here! I need help! Stay calm. We don't want to make any sparks. <laughs> Who are you? I'm the fire inspector. And I'm worried that you or one of your stupid friends might try and squeeze a shot off of here. Why? Can't you smell the gas? But, <laughs> but I... <laughs> Dummy. Room's full of toxic gas. Well, not really toxic. More flammable than anything. I mean, if it were toxic, we'd be like... I can't breathe! <laughs> that guy's over there. Don't you dare fire your weapon. I don't know how bright this is. I guess I got my light meter right there. Hey, buddy. You seen any good movies lately? Sorry about killing your friends. Stabity stab. Ooh, right. Get out of that loud place. And back into the darkness. Uh, I think there's a weapon crate around here. In here? No, that's a bathroom. Did something just go fast down there? Like, the way that sounded, it sounded like it was behind me, so I was like... Okay, hold up. Hold up. Where is this guy? And go to sleep. Okay, here we go. Okay, now let's get out of here. It's like this close. Nobody needs to go over here. No one needs to find that body. I don't think we set off any alarms yet, which is good because I'm not always the best with uh, keeping the alarms silent, especially when they decide to uh, set them off randomly sometimes. This deck, starboard side. I'll find the transit ledgers there. That's where they should be keeping them. Careful, quiet. Okay, darkness. Hey, did Lacerda pass through here? Yeah, he was here a few minutes ago, complaining about the ledgers. Bastard. I hope someone cuts his throat. Lacerda is not a man to trifle with. I'm not going oh, to yeah? trifle with him. Give me a hand over here! Yeah. You be quiet. The transit ledgers are forged. They say Lacerda's container is full of sugar cane and coconuts from a man named the Kerry Cobb in Malaysia. We're going to leave these guys here just for the hell of it. I remember that. Uh, yeah. I don't think anyone's going to pass through here. So instead of nuts from Malaysia, Lacerda got guns from an imaginary Russian? Exactly. Now why don't you go find Good out where Lacerda is hiding? The captain probably knows where he is. Good idea. Oh, the captain. Now you head to the bridge and ask.
Oh, I didn't want to use it. I wanted to uh, turn it off. There we go. Oh, wait, wait, this was a medical room, which means medkit. Oh yeah, that sprained ankle is fixed right away with that uh, uh, mucinex right there. A little bit of Tylenol, I'm right as rain. Oh, I almost missed that. Okay, Sam, judging by the numbering on the crates, that's about half. Oh. See if you can find the rest. Open door. Open the door. <laughs> uh, okay, let's go this way. I think maybe Wish you hadn't said that. You are. I'm seeing them too. I was expecting this guy to be a little closer. He's just hunkered down in the corner. Oh my gosh. Let's try and keep things a little quieter. Yeah. You know what I don't understand? Here we are, loaded up with Colombian. Best coffee in the world. And the coffee tastes like bad guano. Exactly. What's up with that? Because Captain Diego buys the cheapest coffee he can find. Ooh. Why? Because cheap coffee sweats more. Makes it harder for the dogs to smell what's hidden inside the coffee. Ah. Alert! What was that? I didn't hear that. Go to sleep. Anything in here? Oh, that's the inner stairwell, I think. Wait, no. I think that's the way I get to the captain. Right? Or am I crazy? Good job, Sam. Two more crates to go. Oh, only two. Okay, cool. Oh, hey, hey, buddy. You know, I love this song right here. Sorry to disturb you. Don't think there's anything in there. Helm! See me, Capitan. Meg, you still there? What's up? <laughs> Not as smooth as I would have liked, but hey. Cash the checks the cert has been writing. Here is he. That son of a... He was provoking my men, so I gave him my own cabin to shut him up. That's very kind of you. You coming? Be careful. He you coming in here? personal bodyguards. They look dangerous. I'm not afraid of the Certus thugs. No, they're not Peruvian. They're Europeans, I think. Okay, we're, we're good. We don't need to listen to all that. Lucera is holed up in the captain's quarters. Where's that? Third deck, port side. Go ahead and save again. Just so we don't have to go all the way back to the gas level in case these guys somehow end me. <laughs> Which uh, wouldn't be that big of a stretch. Okay, you can save a little faster than that. Come on, you're not that old. Two interior stairwells are the only access to that deck. Yeah, I could be. What does it mean to you? Okay, what? 
Hey, buddy. How you doing? Oh, I was trying to get you over the side. Hey, buddies. How you doing? Well, it will be two weeks before they can even launch the shuttle, so it might not even matter. And I thought this ship was dangerous. This ship isn't moving at 30,000 kilometers an hour. <laughs> Oh yeah, you didn't hear that? Didn't hear your guy just get stabbed behind you? Yeah, I'm trying not to do a stabbing run, but it's like the easiest and quickest way to like deal with things. It's like, for whatever reason, they just don't hear it most of the time. And we're going to go down. Hey guys, how you doing? Uh, I love the smell of the ocean air. All I smell is dirty noise and bubble. Hey, buddy, how you doing? Uh, you, uh, gonna go talk to your friends? Before you know it, we'll be sweating in some jungle. Never heard of anybody getting perfect in a jungle. <laughs> oh, great. And I never heard of anybody getting eaten by an alligator on a ship. Way to go, Fisher. One more crate to go. Not really sure where that last crate is, but uh, we'll find it. Oh, really? You guys are going to split up? Let's try and not be a noob about this. Hey, I hear that. Back off. And that somehow didn't set off the ship alarm. <sighs> I love stealth, but I'm kind of bad at it. <laughs> Actually, it's only because I'm kind of willfully choosing to be, because it's like, I could have easily scanned that crate and gone back up the ladder without engaging those guys. Like, I didn't have to do that. But... <laughs> It's not really that fun to just like ghost your way through places. I mean, in my personal opinion, it's like someone's got to die. What does that say about my personality? <laughs> Inner stairwell? Here? No, this is outside. Right? Oh, here? No, this is outside still. Okay, I swear I'm not dumb. Maybe down here. Yeah, I think it does require us to backtrack just a little bit. Gonna go... Over here? Yeah? I tell you, never, never oh, in my yeah. life have I been so insulted. I don't see why you're so upset. You got your... Oh, health pack. I don't care if it's hard. You think my job is easy? No. But this insert forcing me to bribe an inspector <laughs> out of my own pocket. No. This big shot, this vice president, Senor Segundo Ruiz de Medeiros. Ha! I'll show him. Fine. Mark my words. I'll make him pay. I'll make him pay double. For my name is not Hugo Lacerda. Great. I need another drink. I'm sure this isn't supposed to be open. Let me see. Are you going to come and check that out? Now where would that fat big stash is? <sighs> Don't make a scene. <gasps> Madre de Dios. Not exactly. But if it makes you feel better <laughs> to pray, please don't kill me. 
I'm sorry, but uh, you're not supposed to be here. We're gonna take a little trip. Good job, Fisher. I'll inform the Joint Chiefs that Lacerda is no longer a threat. Your primary objectives are completed. We can extract you whenever you're ready. Okay, but where's that last uh, crate? Oh, seriously? He was behind me! Where did, where did you go? Why were you there? I swear, he was supposed to be at the table shooting the breeze with the other guy. Oh my god, that scared the hell out of me. Whew. Oh my gosh. Yeah, that was uh, not what I wanted. Okay, so I'm not really sure where the last crate is. Da -da. No? Underneath the stairs? Did I get that one? Did I get the one that was underneath the stairs? This one? Okay, I got that one. Hmm. Well. I already got the primary objectives. Real quick, I'm going to check over here. Right? Over here? Oh, yeah, yep. Yeah, I think it might be in here. Hey, buddy. How you doing? Oh, are you kidding me? Really? Hmm. Okay. Well, I'm not going to stress too much about it. Uh, this gameplay is already going for about 30-ish, 30, almost 35 minutes, so uh, I think we're going to go ahead and call it there. Uh, if you'd like to play this game, uh, you know, you can pick it up at your local retro store, or I think you can download it uh, on your Xbox. Uh, I'm not sure exactly about that because I, I don't own an Xbox One. I don't really... The newest system I have is a Xbox 360, so... <laughs> There we go. That was the cargo ship. Now, like I said, if you'd like to play this game, you want to find all the crates on the secondary objective, uh, you know, you can pick up this game. You can find it online, find it at your local retro store if they have it in stock, because it took me a while to find this copy uh, myself, and I was looking for it for a while. But, you know, or I think you might be able to download it on your Xbox. I mean, that's worth checking out the, uh, the store. Because uh, they often have a lot of the um, old classics, you know, like uh, Halo and, uh, you know, uh, Dishonored, stuff like that. Anyway, uh, but if you, uh, in if you enjoyed the video, you know, feel free to uh, leave a comment, uh, leave a like, subscribe, you know, it all helps. I'm just happy that you're here checking out the content. Uh, I think we're going to continue this probably maybe on a weekly basis. If I, you know, if I have time to get to it, <clears throat> just keep going right along. Uh, continue with the, uh, the, the <clears throat> excuse me, <laughs> uh, continue right along with the next missions. I don't remember exactly what the next one is, but uh, it should be interesting. Uh, you know, come watch my commentary, my, uh, my own random humor as I attempt to complete these missions as stealthily and as efficiently as possible. I might not always get all the secondary objectives, but you know I'm going to get the primaries and I'm going to do it with a smile. Anyway, that's all I got. I'm going to go ahead and catch you guys next time.